Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Chris Gordon. And I'm Caleb Farnetti. Today is Friday, October 19th, and we're here with your morning announcements. Starting off in club announcements, IMCO will be having a meeting Monday, October 22nd at 3.30 in HP 10. BSU and Action Civics Club are hosting a field trip on October 30th for the movie The Hate You Give. Tickets are available for $12 at the student store to the first 50 paid students with completed permission slips. This field trip requires a commitment to participate in an open discussion on Friday, November 2nd from 3.30 to 5 p.m. Attention all key clubbers that are attending Fall Rally North. There will be mandatory spirit meetings Thursday and Friday after school. They will go over spirit chants and information regarding the trip. Attention Powder Puff cheerleaders. The pre-senior night uh, performance has been canceled. The Fourth Wall Club will be hosting a haunted house on October 25th from 4 to 9 at the PAC. The price of admission will only be $5. And now, Kaylin Kevin. Boys What's Pop in Wolfpack? Pack. I'm Kaylee Ota. And I'm Kevin Cativo. And this is Pop. Where we pop in and show you guys posts of the pack. Make sure you use the hashtag CHSWPTV to the chance to be on our next Friday show. Our first post is from Danielle at the Powder Puff. Looks like they had a great time. Anyone who takes a picture with Tony is a winner. Our next post is from Kiyomi and showing her photography fails during the pink out. They clean. Our last post is from Lamar and Chris after the Powder Puff game as Jolie's favorite cheerleaders. Looking great, guys. Now let's take a look at our Wolf of the Week, Miss Warren. Today is Miss Warren's last day, and we just want to thank Miss Warren for everything she has done to this school. And contributing for making this CHS the best it can be. Hi, I'm Mrs. Warren in the Career Center, and I'm the Wolf of the Week. I've gone to a couple colleges. Straight out of high school, I went to University of the Pacific, and then I actually dropped out of college and went back to school um, in my 40s. And which I think speaks to the fact that you can always pursue your education. It's always good to be learning. And sometimes your career path and your life path takes several different um, avenues. I am gonna miss the students, absolutely. Um, I love working with students. I've been here since we opened and I'm really gonna miss, I'm really gonna miss the kids. My advice for seniors is don't get too stressed out, don't get too overwhelmed. Uh, if you've been working hard to go to a four-year college, just uh, believe in yourself, do your applications, do what you need to do, um, just hang in there. And if you're a senior who maybe hasn't uh, put your full effort into school and you're not sure what you're gonna do, it's not too late. A lot of, lot of different avenues to be successful. And for freshmen, I would say definitely be mindful of your classes, your grades, but also get involved. Find out what you like, um, who you are, pursue things outside of the classroom, get involved in volunteer work, and um, really enjoy high school. I was a stay-at-home mom for a number of years, and when I decided to go back to work, I saw a job posting for the Career Center at Monterey Trail High School, and when I read the description, I knew it was my job. I love talking to kids about all the opportunities that there are for them, um, for four-year colleges, for community colleges, for technical ed. There's so many opportunities, and students typically don't know everything that's out there, and it is so much fun to help kids explore all the possibilities for their life and I just enjoy helping students so I've been really fortunate to work in the Career Center at Monterey Trail and then come over here and I've been here in the Career Center since we opened. Well like I said I've, I've been here since the school opened and I have absolutely loved this job. I have, I have so greatly enjoyed working with students but after 12 years of doing the same thing, it's time for a change and I will be moving on to working at a student support center and I will be providing support services to the homeless families in our district. So it's bittersweet leaving. I will miss the kids very much, I'll miss the students, but I also feel good about what I'm going to be doing in the future. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Kaylee Ote. And I'm Kevin Cativo. See you all next week. 
Attention juniors and seniors, the CRC building located across from Pinkerton will be offering courses next spring. An informational meeting will be held next Monday, October 22nd. Get a pass in the Career Center if you would like to attend that meeting. Tonight, the Wolfpack Marching Band and the Color Guard will be presenting their fifth and final field show of the season. This show is special as, as it is dedicated to the class of 2019. We hope to see everyone there cheering on the football team and checking out the show after the game. Red Cross is having an event to create holiday cards for veterans, so please come join them from 3.15 to 4.15 in the MP Room on Friday, October 26th. Boograms are back at CO. Come to the table in the lunchroom and send a boogram to your friend. It's $2 for a note and a full-size candy bar for any friend. Make sure you know their Advo teacher's name or classroom number. Senior Movie Night is coming up. Join us seniors on Wednesday, October 26th in the quad to bond while we watch Monster House. Bring blankets or lawn chairs to watch the movie. It's $2 at the door, free popcorn and drinks will be provided, and we hope to see all seniors there. For students who are having trouble covering their books for Term 2, CSF is having a textbook covering fundraiser. Come drop off your books in the library after school next Wednesday or from today until next Friday during lunch. A plain cover will be $1 and a cover with handles and title will be $2. CO students, please join the first annual Pumpkin Palooza where you can decorate a pumpkin with your favorite staff member and win some cool prizes. There are three categories, so you have multiple chances to win. Sign-ups are only this week. More information about the event will be on the sign-up papers outside the leadership door in the cafeteria and on the leadership window. Hurry, sign up ends this Friday and takes less than five minutes of your time. The first 60 students to sign up have a guaranteed spot. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Chris Gordon. And I'm Caleb Farnetti. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. See you, See at, you at the, the football, football game, game Wolfpack. Wolfpack.